Hello and welcome to episode 40 of our East Coast Mainline map. Episode 40. It's a lot of episodes. Oh, excuse you. Guess the station time. I had to uh, I had to place the camera very carefully on this one. It's a bit of a tricky one. There's not much going on around here. You may have may or may not remember this one. It's on the Midland Main Line. Uh, I'm hoping the bus depot over there gives it a oh, bus stop, bus station, gives it away a little bit and all these trains. We've been working the other side of here as well. Anyway, let me zoom out. There we go. Can you tip? No, I'm not going to say it. No Rolf Harris today. <laughs> It is attached to Barnet. It's not Barnet Station, obviously. That's the other side, and it's New Barnet on the East Coast Main Line. Let's bring this back up. Let's turn all this Ching Ching off. There we go. It is uh, Elstree and Boreham Wood. Just prove it there. Obviously, we can't see <laughs> what it is because it's Barnet, and we made this up. There you go, guys. Elstree and Boreham Wood. If you got that one, very well done, because not the easiest. Busy day today. I'm going to get straight on with it. And just like the pro I am, I left <laughs> I left files open all over my notes. There we go. Sorted. Lots going on. I've done... If you've been following my tweets, <laughs> you'll know I did a bit, a bit much on the uh, scenery side of things over that way where we'll be heading shortly Wildstone and uh, Watford uh, talking of tweets I want to thank uh, John Deards for his retweets very much appreciated it uh, I do want to uh, get the videos out there for like-minded people if they're into this or even maybe get some new people into transport fever that'll be kind of cool it'll only help us all in the long run as uh, the more players there are the more likely urban games will continue to support this and maybe even create a transport fever too there's a there's an exciting prospect also john tron oh before i go on with what john tron's done for me and it's and it's kind of cool we're going to let this train come in and then i'm going to pause it quickly Let's get on with what John, uh, John Tron has done. I love this. I'm already excited. Look at this. We have, we have some track rules. I will, uh, I will be linking this in the description below. It's a, a customized one he did for me, even with all of his uh, high school work. Very much appreciated. So thank you for that. But this one's what we're interested in. 15 miles per hour. Everybody, or anybody who knows. Uh, King's Cross, all this mess around here that we, I, I kind of got the the gist of the entrance. Obviously, it's it's not quite like this, but this section here and about halfway under the gasworks tunnel is 15 mile per hour speed limit. And so we click on this, and we'll go with this. You see, I placed one in here, and it's limited this section of track 15, but we we want it all. And we want about halfway through the tunnel. And then we want about 40 mile an hour up to here. We'll do. And then we'll go 60 up to Finsbury Park. And then we'll take a look at how that affects the gameplay. Uh, for us, we don't have um, any finances, so to speak, because we have that turned off. And I'll talk about turning those back on later on. Okay, so let's upgrade these. Uh, not with catenary. We'll upgrade all of these. Oh, I don't know. Oh, that's probably gone the right distance. All to 15. I mean, technically we're downgrading, right? It's not really all that's going too far. Let's shift and get some smaller segments there. And this one hasn't... I feel like we're missing one somewhere. Are we missing one here? Yeah, I feel like we're... 
I don't know what's going on there. It looks like we're missing a couple. Who knows? Let's get all these in anyway. And then we'll worry about that in a second. You notice them all going to 15. I don't think. I think it's just different texture colors. Make sure we're not going too far away. As long as all these say 15, I'll be a happy camper. Oh, there we go. That's about right. That'll do. Because we can't get much shorter than that. So we've got 15 approach. I saw a 38 in there somewhere. Where was that? Did you see that? Look, every time we zoom out. Around here somewhere. I don't think it will matter. You're not going to get to speed up anytime soon. <laughs> that 186 when you get into the platform. That's a, that's a little sad, but they, they're not going to pick up enough speed. I don't know where where we're looking there that's oh, stop fiddling around we can have a look how it runs so let's then take we haven't got 40 we'll take 45 close enough uh we'll go there and there this should be good enough let's not get the uh track above it we'll get all these to a maximum of 40 Yeah, we, we might struggle a bit, obviously, because we've already done this. Uh, 45, not 40. We'll take it to the bridge as 40, I think. Uh, 45, sorry. It should be 40, but we're, we're, we're more than happy with 45. The, not much of a difference. I'm going to guess 45 round here as well, maximum. That works. Okay. Obviously, some are going to be a bit slower, which which we don't mind. And then all the way up to Finsbury Park, we'll go with 60. That's over the bridge. We don't mind a little bit of overlap. You're not really going to notice it. Now, imagine trains slow down and speed up at uh, slightly different points because it's kind of a, a judgment call from the uh, the driver. And down here too. And there. I don't know what this would be down here. I guess we can go 60, right? Slow them down a touch. Yeah, I like I like the looks of that. And round here is probably a bit slower than this, but we'll put it as 60. We'll put this as 62. Beautiful. And then probably slow down to 45 on here. Ace. Loving this. Loving this. Thank you, John Tron. Wanted to do this for ages. We'll get 60 on here and here. And there. Beautiful. We don't need to do much else, really. Uh, this could be uh, all slowed down. But we'll just go with the, the approach from after Finsbury Park all the way to King's Cross. We'll unpause that. Get rid of this. A bit garish. You may have noticed we're into 1972 almost. Currently in tw uh, Boxing Day for those of you in the UK. <laughs> Obviously it's not currently Boxing Day and it's not 1971 either. So let's see how this uh, all works. Do we have any trains approaching? We probably do. This might turn out as a good example. I'd love one of the fast trains to be coming in. Please tell me you're coming this way. No, I think you're I think you're heading out towards No you are coming there. No, yes. <laughs> oh, that was interesting. Okay. We're gonna sit here then for a little bit and just see how that all plays out. Ooh, let's save it first. There we go. Now, as I mentioned briefly, not not so long back, um I did say we're gonna be turning on finances so we're going to see how this map handles eventually with the real game there you go he's a bit slower now ignore the judderiness I, I think that's just something with station approaches and stuff uh the connections between the the tracks on some of these stations he might do it too oh no he's pretty cool now isn't that better i think you're coming in the wrong place sir that's not where you're supposed to be what's going on there I will get to this 
shortly. Yeah, you're supposed to be over there. I think that's because we changed the tracks. We'll ignore that. He might hold everything up, though, being in the wrong place, you silly sausage. Right. Yeah, where was I? Now I've lost what I was saying. Yes, turning on uh, finances. I'm going to live stream kind of the, the last... Sort of the last episode of the season. It'll be a live stream, probably on YouTube or Twitch. I don't know. I'll leave that for you guys to decide a bit closer to the time. Uh, whichever you'd prefer. I love how they slow down. Yes, that's how the station should be too. Everything's a bit messy at the moment, as they're all kind of in the wrong place. This must be a signal. Yes, it is. Oh yeah, because I couldn't fit I couldn't fit a signal back here. But that's all right. It's fine waiting out there. So they've got that to look forward to. It'll be uh, I'll, I'll I'll attempt to make it a proper stream, and what we'll do is we'll turn on all of the finances and we'll try and cope and make money with this map as wh whatever state it's in then it won't affect the following season it'll be a separate save and we'll just have a mess around and chat and, and do that sort of thing if anyone's interested obviously if there's not the interest i'll just do maybe a a, a a video i'll make sure the vod's available that's for sure doesn't this look better guys Look, they're crawling into King's Cross. I love that. That is much better. Another thing we're going to do... Uh, I want to thank uh, a guy called Pi for this. Is I, I didn't think about this. We could turn all, also take the, uh, the brakes off the towns a little bit and let them grow at a normal rate, which for the game is quite aggressively. But we'll do that too and see, that, see if they uh, all start springing up and and how much stress that will put on my computer i mean there's a there's a reason why i made that massive map settings mod and it, it's just to tame things a little bit when you're dealing with huge maps with a lots going on so straight off the bat i love this new approach to king's cross it's beautiful i love them crawling in and out the station like this It's, it's much more realistic, don't you think? And that looks amazing. With the British Rail everywhere, Intercity on the carriages, on the Mark II coaches there. BSO slung in the middle. No one said whether that's right or not, so I'm going to take it it's right. I think it would be a dining car right in the middle, usually. I'm not... It's been a long time since I've been on a 225 or a 125. I mean, I know this is not, but it, it, it's our version of it. We've got a bit of a hold up here. We, it shouldn't cause any problems, he says. Oh, we've got a train coming in there. Yeah, that's fine. He shouldn't... He's off. He shouldn't cause any problems. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Okay, enough staring at that. For St Pancras here, we're going to do the same, but... Uh, we're going to go 25. I think it's 20, but I'm happy with 25. And we're going to do the same. Let's put the, uh, the track speeds up there. I don't like them rushing into the uh, into the station like full on. It's it's not very realistic. This might upset all the trains, obviously. As we saw, train 49. A few episodes ago, had um, a special moment and decided to run off. We need to... Can we not go that far out? Yeah, that's fine. About there. Okay, that's close enough. Well, I guess we can go there. That's fine. Yes, slow down as you're coming in. We'll get all this done. And then we'll get on with the what we're supposed to be doing. In the, oh, what I have planned for this oh no actually oh yes I probably would be something like that under there slow down you don't want to be crashing through there at a bajillion miles an hour 
Yeah, we'll, we'll put that there. Like that. That looks beautiful. Alright, let's do these as well. We're almost done. And then we're heading back on to the... Oh, oh, oh there we go. Yeah, if you uh, ever encounter that when you're upgrading, sometimes it's just that it's not in view. So just bring the uh, entire section of track you want to up, upgrade, downgrade, uh, into view, and then uh, you should be able to get away with it. Sometimes it's just you have to find the right one. Like this one, you might have to do these first in a certain order. That's just that. There you go. See, look, now it's starting to... Yeah, hold shift if you uh, all else fails, and then just keep going. We might get that nasty break sound, but there's, um, I think that's a, literally a bug in the programming. So not much we can do about that. We don't want to go that far out. We could just, uh, say he's slightly overzealous on the braking. We'll, we'll do that. We'll do it all. We'll do it all. There we go. All the way to there. Sounds good. Beautiful. Right, so that slows us all down superficially, but more realistic for a terminus station. And then away he goes. 25 is not that slow anyway, but hey, look at that. Look at him staying at 25. It's beautiful. Yes, I'm really loving. Is he slowing down? Look at him. Oh, <laughs> he's stopping for a red, so yes, he would be slowing down. But now he won't uh, speed off at crazy speeds down here. Beautiful. Okay, busy episode. And I've been waffling on 18 minutes already. That is silly. Let's show you what I did. Not up there. I wasn't that far up. I did all this. I actually did this last episode and I forgot to show you guys because I was all excited about building uh, that area around Bushy. Talking of Bushy, look at all these bushies. That was awful. I, will, I promise I will not do any more terrible jokes. Okay, anyway, bushes and trees, fields, that's what I've gone with. And I just filled all this in. Um, time is of the essence with uh, my episodes because I'm doing a lot of research try and balance that out I will go back to doing some time lapses for those that love it so don't worry about that I just uh, I don't don't really want to do them every time there's a video as it's just fields and fields and bushes for the most part maybe if there's uh, something oh what's going on here oh it's a Whittlesea bus Wow. Really? I didn't see that one come. Oh, we're already in 1972. Oh, yeah, you're looking a bit old. Let's give them these new buses then. That's an easy fix. I, I still don't think I looked up what these buses were. I think I did and I forgot. And because I haven't named it on there. Which we have started doing, which makes more sense to me. Okay, back to where we were. We should actually pause this. We don't want to be flying through the years, do we? What's this place? See if we can guess what this is from looking here. Midland Mainline? Yes. That is Flitic. We want it. There's Leighton Buzzard. This here, quickly. Oldbury is actually going to be Tring. Tring's there. Oldbury there. And the station kind of lands in the middle. If you're wondering why that's there... <laughs> out of all the places I could have put around here. Again, I'm more excited for the next season. Uh, not next season, next map that we do. Because I'm not going to hold back on like small towns and villages. Even bus services are going to be a thing in the next map. A lot more detail. Uh, hopefully a bit bigger map too. I, I don't know what the game will allow, but I'm going to try and push it as far as I can and have all the little towns and suburbs so we can get some uh, solid detailing done and even more realistic uh, rail networks and bus networks going 
So really excited for that. But we can't we can't just dump this guy. This map is still looking good. Uh, it, it's kind of done with the old transport beaver version in mind, but with all the performance upgrades, it we can go I think a little bit further. I already went a bit crazy with this one. So yeah, I've done this. All of this work around here, just filling in some fields and some greenery. Uh, I changed this layout. See here, there. I wanted this three track thing going on entering the station. Ooh, should we get our track rules out? What should we make this? 15 seems about right. More than likely. You can correct me on that and I'll change to whatever the speed they should be. But I would imagine they're not too quick coming into a terminus for the London Overground. Not too quick at all. Just have you like that. We'll do it all the way up to the light. Pretty much a signal. Sort of the entry to the station. I'll float. Yeah, just there would be a little bit up. Yeah, let's do it like that. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, this is probably not too quick either. Yeah, and it sounds about right. There. Beautiful. I don't know why you would have that like that. In fact, that doesn't make much sense at all, does it? Let's just put a normal one there. Because that bit makes no sense. There we go. It's 45 anyway. There. We have 15 coming into a terminal station. That seems about right. I believe this one might be the same too. I see I'm getting carried away now. When we can do this from the get-go, I think it will be a lot better. Uh, sure, like that. That seems to work. That'll be fine. This yard will probably be all slow too, but we're not using it. We won't worry too much about that for now. See what I mean? A few little uh, bits and bobs I put in here. Change the track layout. Just a little scenery work. Should we have time today? I want to put a walkway across here. There isn't one, but it will kind of uh, hide this little path thing. What do you reckon, guys? Looking a bit better? I should have really, really recorded this for a time lapse. I did loads of work. I also changed this. It was wrong. This is more how it should be now, given our scale. I changed the angle of the A41 ready for this episode. Kind of going up this way and around the south. Uh, well, we go south of Kings Langley and then to the west. Kings Langley is going to sit about here. I mean, it should kind of just kiss the M25 there. So we'll, we'll go somewhere close. You'll see we have uh, a little hoarding thing a wall across here shouldn't hit the the overground trains going through should be all right uh what else did we get what uh, did i do oh yeah down here see remember that little cubby hole we did i put some boxes and some things in here and let's remove that that looked good much better so today's show uh we'll start with king's langley i think because uh I would like to get, I don't know what trains they're going to be. I did look it up. I think it's London Midland trains and Southern are going to operate from here to Euston. Euston. Southern, however, are going to go all the way to, it's East Croydon, but I guess we can go to South Croydon or something along those lines. And they'll go via, the, the Southern trains will go via Wembley. And I guess we could have a go at Clapham Junction, too. We're definitely going to have a go at... Uh, there's another one down here that I want to put in. London Bridge. Right. Enough talking. Let's get on with this, shall we? Alrighty. All saved and raring to go. We get this station in. It's going to be my favourite. And we're going to attempt... To pull off that, uh, that thing we had going down here because it does bow out the uh, outer track. 
which I believe oh the what this kind of thing here that we've got going on this Boeing let's get the right tracks and let's start off by getting rid of all of these extra paths because they're not needed there we go beautiful uh, it's a small station so we'll get that in straight away the actual station building the length of the station is quite long now you remember last episode I did figure out how to do this however that was yes uh, not yesterday it was a couple of days ago I spent yesterday researching let's see if I can remember shall we so far so good <laughs> there's not much going on there it's fairly straight other than the uh, we're gonna go with quite a big station because I do want it to uh, sit quite far down here and and kind of almost kiss the M25 now the real reason we are down this far there is a good reason for it get this a bit better is because I want to put all three stations in uh, we want to put Apsley and Hemel Hempstead in as well so if we shove this far south of King's Langley on our map and closer to uh, Watford we can uh, recreate that quite well I think 240 will do us it's quite long probably not that long but uh, it gives us a lot of reach that way so here we go then can I do this? I don't think it's got any coverings on it, to be honest. Just go with that. Wasn't it platform variation? What even was it? There it is. There it is. <laughs> After all that, that's all I had to do. Platform variation, guys. Put it on 10%, and you get that Boeing outer, outer two pla uh, outer platforms and track. I love that. There's a lot of stations like that. The uh, the through sta uh, the through platforms are one and two on this, with uh, London Midland stopping on the outer. We need some fences. What colour should they be out here? Yellow or green? Green? London Midland? Sure. We'll just go with that. Okay. Let's get her in, shall we? We'll have to leave a bit of room to make this bridge, but. Kind of the right angle. Hang on, are we looking north? Let's make sure we're looking north. I have got the map open. That is about the right angle. We are going to... You'll see some elevation change shortly. I feel like maybe we can go round a little bit more. Let's do it. We're in. Now, Apsley <laughs> has a golf course next to it. Yes. I've yet to... Uh, it, it's not actually Sunday yet. So I don't know what you think about my golf course. Actually, was it Sunday's episode or was it Tuesday's? I want to say Tuesday's. <laughs> no, it's Sunday's. i tell you what, I'll stop guessing because I'll always get it wrong. Right, let's just connect that up for now. Now let's figure out if we can do this. Uh, we're just going to go with normal tracks. We don't need anything fancy for this. What I'm hoping for is we can get all this connected. And it will look amazing. We are obviously going to need to get rid of this. Unfortunately. But we'll put it back in. We'll start heading towards... Uh, that looks fine to me. Let's uh, make sure it's flat. 160 is more than enough. They should be... Uh, see, this is a perfect angle. We just hook on there. If we can get the M25 over it, I'll be really happy. We'll go like this for now. Just put it out a little bit longer. We need to be aiming for this... What will be a tunnel there. So we should maybe... Maybe start going that way. I don't know whether it is 125 down here. I'm going to go 110 on the outside. They're shorter commuter trains in the on the inside anyway. I believe this needs to go either over the... This 
Might be in the wrong place. Hmm, that's awkward. Might have to delete these and bring this round sooner. Yeah. It needs to go over this. We're about to make a tunnel here. And this A41 needs to go over and then meet up with the M25, which is going to go around to the west of Watford. Question is, can we first get this working? <laughs> That'll be the thing. Right, M25 road, that's you. Oh, see, ruined. Ruined. Come on, don't do this to me. Let's get rid of all this. Ooh, official episode time. It was bound to happen, right? Yeah, let's get rid of all this. Maybe that's not helping the situation at all. Do you know what? It was going too well, wasn't it? Far too well. It might just be the angle, but we'll see. Mm, is it just too high? Not high enough? Not high enough, probably. We can probably get a little more height. Take this back. Let's get a... What about here? We'll just start going up sooner. At a gentle slope. Oh, I think I was going up there. Maybe we need to go up more aggressively. See, that ain't gonna... Oh, come on. Well, I mean, I guess we could do something like that. That's a bit excessive. Or we could not do that. <laughs> yeah, that's where the M25 goes. Okay, well, we'll start out here. We'll start going up instead. See if we can get even more of an angle. Go up a bit. Go up a bit quicker. How are we looking there? Don't like that. Don't like that at all. Oh, this is... Normally the roads are not a problem. What if we get the height and then we, then we smooth it out? The ramp. Maybe that's a better bet. Does that give us a bit more? That gives us a bit more. Maybe if we come a bit straighter... And then we really do kiss this. Oh, there we go. Alright. Then we Oh beautiful. That'll do it. That works. Yes. I like that. And then we can sort this out. And make sure it's smoother. That's for sure. Probably go... Uh, maybe we can just start going further back. Watch me ruin it now. Does that look better? That looks better. There we go. Like it didn't happen. Like we didn't have to do all that. Yeah, look, it's kind of a, a gradual slope now. It might be ruined here, but... We'll see. We can fix it. Oh, that that just kind of works, doesn't it? There we go. Beautiful. All done. We have King's Langley. Is it called it the King's Langley? <laughs> you beauty. It's obviously not going to call that one Apsley in the middle. When we come round to Apsley, we're going to look at it. It goes dips down. Fortunately, uh, it's kind of on an embankment anyway all around there, so we stay up higher. Now, can we get this tunnel in? This is what I want to do. would like to get this in, and it's just like trees and stuff. It'd be beautiful. Actually, click on it might help. Yeah, we're going to have to get rid of that. Hopefully, Watford wasn't working there. Now, let's see how this goes. This just works. We need to make a tunnel. Oop, wrong way. Come on. We can sort this bit. Hmm. Maybe if we go further back. Let's try there. Obviously we can uh, dip it down a little bit. Oop. There we 
go. How's that looking? Can't tell. That's a bit too much, isn't it? It's about the right length, though. I'll, I'll take that. And we're looking this side. Alright, there's a bit of a... We can... Uh, take this back further now. Now we've got the bridge in. Please don't ruin it. Beautiful. I mean, yeah, it's 90, but... Alright, isn't it? Trying to see. That might be better. How's that looking? It's not a bad gradient, is it? I mean, it's not terrible. Hopefully do the same here. Yeah, I am liking that. I think we got away with it. I think we got away with it. Now, they're going to join up with these briefly, and then we're going to split off and go the other way. I mean, it does suck a little bit that they slow to 90, but it's not the end of the world. Come on. There we go. Maybe about there. And then we'll head off and do our curly-whirly bit around here. You're going to have to obviously go down too. Kind of works. Let's take it. Beautiful. That's roughly what it does. More or less. Close enough, I would like to say. And it's not too slopey. There'll be trees and stuff in the middle. We don't want to get rid of this in... Oh, as I do. Put this on. The one time you want it on uh, medium, really. Because we just want to... See, the game's running too smooth. It just, like, eats everything. It's not running too smooth. Don't say that. Okay, we got that. We got this. Beautiful. We got away with it. Except we need to bring this round sooner. So, fortunately, all that work I did is uh, a waste of time. <laughs> well, it's not a lot, is it? Let's get rid of the um, bushes and such that we placed down because they're no longer required. Beautiful, like it never happened. And I guess we're going to come round a bit sharper. That's what's going to happen. Uh, we need to kind of head... Get rid of all of this. We need to head there kind of thing. That would make a lot more sense for us. We need to pull that back there. Actually, this can still carry on. Let's do this. We'll improvise a bit. We'll go across this way. No, don't do that. That would be silly. Go across this way. We'll start to head that way. It's hard to get the... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? The, the scale right all the time. I mean, you know what you want to do, and then when, once you get into the map, it's it's then a case of lining everything up, which is kind of tricky. You can go there. And here. I think I'll take those. Not, I won't take that, though. I don't like that at all. No ridges. Thank you very much. We're not, we're not doing ridges. In fact, we could kind of have this. How's that looking? Is that a bit better? No, not like that. I would kind of like this to be uh, kind of through town. We could go with a bit of that. There we go. Not too bad. Don't know what we're doing with this bit just yet now. But we'll connect it up and leave it be. This bit can stay. We can uh, maybe have like a little road. Uh... Coming out here. Now I'm kind of just making stuff up as I go along, but it's fine. There we go. It's kind of a sort of mess going on. We'll, we'll take it. <laughs> Sorry, Watford. You, you've 
He's just got a mess. That's that's what you're having. But it, it kind of does what I want it to do. Eventually. I don't know what we're doing about this yet. Let's just get rid of it for now. Get rid of these. We'll put them back in in a second. I want them all in together. Okay. Go around here. A little bit of detailing. Bet you're glad that I didn't record it now because we just ended up deleting some. There we go. All fixed. Like nothing happened. Sort of. Around here. How are we doing for time? Alright. We might get away with this. Plenty of time left yet. Famous last words. Beautiful. So now our M25 needs to swing round. And kind of stay on an, em an embankment. Doesn't have to be... Let's, let's shove it up there, shall we? Not the right one, is it? It's this one. We can probably come round a little. No, stay on the embankment. Because you're going to have to kind of make a junction here. Where the... Uh, the uh, A41, like, goes underneath it. Now we can, uh, we can probably start heading down, mm, ish, maybe. Let's see. I don't want to go too, well, I don't know. The M25 is sometimes on an embankment, why not, right? We are going to need the, uh, the room. This here... Then branches off, you see. So if we take this, and hopefully we can go underneath and head... This might work. We probably don't need to go down, though, to be honest. Let's see. Yeah, you see, you don't need to do that. We can probably start heading up. Alright, switch back to that one. Perfect. Kind of perfect. It'll do. Alright. I mean, once we've got the... Uh, the old smoothing tool out. Now we can go... On high. I think we might... Have done it. Guys. Now our... A41... Is eventually... when This is why I'm not going to move this up too much. What we're eventually going to do is, near Hemel Hempstead Station, we, we go and meet the track again. So for now, we're just going to put this in. And think about getting uh, Kings Langley all hooked up. This is pretty much all trees along here. A lot of, a lot of greenery around this area. Which is okay for us. We don't mind that. There we go. Beautiful. Before I get carried away with that. Let's start heading off this way as well. So we've got a rough idea of where we go. And we're going to need to stay straight. Because if you notice the terrain drops down. So we don't want to. We don't want to lose it too much. Uh, uh, we don't. We, well we definitely don't want to gain any height do we. So we'll join these back in. We've got our little curved station. For now, because we're going to operate on this line, we'll put this in here, not there. IRL, so. It'll be two way for now, and then one way here. And uh, Kings Langley will just act as a terminus point for now. The fast trains will be going through that way. That won't change, so we can put some. Signals in there. You believe we got this in? Pretty awesome. But these is one way. We know what we're doing with those. Uh, we'll probably we'll probably need a bus service next next episode. That's for sure. We won't deal with bus services today. We'll do a little bit of scenery here, just so it's not looking so bare. What we 
I, what I feel like we should be doing today is getting the bare bones in rather than scenery work. And then next episode, we can uh, work on that scenery a little more, add the bus services, figure out how Kings Langley is going to grow a little bit. Put in Apsley, maybe. Decide whether we want to do another uh, <laughs> golf course. Very large air quotes around that. I mean, it's all right, weren't it? It weren't. It weren't too bad. I would like to get these entrances at least bushed up, treed up, so we know what we're doing. I like that. So far, so good. And get this side done as well. And then I'm thinking we uh, possibly throw in, hopefully, Wilston. Or Harrow Wilston, I believe. Get some trees in. Down this middle bit. This is like literally all trees. So that's already starting to look a little bit like it's supposed to be there. And that's a good start. Eh, uh, yes. See, once we've got more trees up here, you won't see the daylight coming through. More foresty. Beautiful. Don't like that. We can probably sort this out. Just delete this back so this is smoother. Same with this one, more than likely. There we go. We should still get the uh, tunnel going on. There we go. Beautiful. I don't like that. Oh, it's got rid of all my tree work. Look at that. Who would have thought that would have happened? What about that? Oh, that side wasn't even... Wasn't even a thing. It's fine. They're not going to be going that fast around here, so it doesn't really matter. Because they ain't going to pick up speed fast enough. There we go. It's a bit better anyway. I didn't like that uh, sudden elevation change. But we have to get up here anyway. So it doesn't really matter. I don't know what the real track's like, whether it goes up like that. Obviously everything shrunk down for us, so... Elevations would be uh, slightly more aggressive than in real life. Because we don't have the room. We have to uh, make do. Still looks good. Beautiful. So, we have King's Landley connected. We have some of our overground connected. Okay, now we're looking on time. Let's go for this. Back to the station. This one, however, is a pretty huge station. And I mean, we'll go a maximum for this. Same size. First off, we need uh, six tracks. There we go. The inside tracks, platforms one and two, which are on the, the west side-ish, west-ish, are the overground and underground. So that's going to be on that side. We'll put some covering on. I don't think it's on a curve. I'm going to check whether we might need to put it on one. I don't think we will. We are going to have an extra entrance on the other side. Because there is a walkway above. Now, here's my thinking. When there's a walkway, you should put another, uh, another entrance on the other side. Even if there isn't technically. Because we don't have walkways over the top and it doesn't really connect properly to cities anyway how it would in real life so while i just scroll through here endlessly <laughs> i do like that going on that kind of works it, it's not really like it has an extra track on the the outside which is probably disused actually no i don't like it like that that's not how it is it's it's 
pretty much straight like that. We'll do that. I prefer that. Now, where's our un not unaffected platforms? Extra large. Let's go with that. Beautiful. It's not really extra large, is it? We want uh, both or B, I believe. Surface. Excellent. So we got that in. Now this is our Wieldston. Harrow and Wieldston. I think it's kind of that angle. Might have to have a quick look at that. What else did I say I was putting on? Covers. We need some covers. We're on zero at the moment. Not too much. We'll go with 50%. That kind of works. I'm going to quickly uh, drag the map down. We want to be at kind of... This angle works. And I think that will connect us up nicely. And we want a bit of a gap. If we go, say, here, let's do it. Let's put it in. For now, we'll just hook her up to uh, the town. We won't do anything fancy with it just yet. We want this in. And then we'll, we'll start making some sort of high street. But I don't know what we're doing with it just yet. Beautiful. Bit of smoothing. Just to tidy all that up. I don't know what we're doing with this yet. They are building back up. Good for them. I mean, we did destroy them last episode. So. Good for you. I feel like... Hang on a sec. Keep covering up my notes. I'm terrible. I feel like uh, we're going to need a terminus point here for the to kind of represent the underground. It's the uh, the brown line. Uh, Bakerloo. Yes. That stops there. So this was swinging around like that. We might be able to just do this and not worry about it too much. I don't think there are any uh, crossovers and such. We'll, we will check that, though. So I think for now, we just hook her up. We, we are going to need one for our purposes, because obviously we don't go that far. This outside one. There we go. We got those in. Ooh, not that. Let's get this all up. I don't know what we're doing with this yet, guys. But I... We really need to get this station in. So we can uh, have some more reference points for our map. The more reference points we have, the easier it becomes later on to get other things in. And then it just kind of snowballs after that point. The, the hardest thing is getting a new area. And getting some uh, major landmarks and stations in. So this is what we're going with so far. These should be in the right platform order. Yes, one, two, three, four, five, six. There was a seven here, I believe. But anyway, this uh, five and six. Six is heading south. Five north. Uh, that will go to Milton Keynes Central, Watford Junction. This down to Houston. Uh, both. London, Midland, and Southern both share these. This uh, platform one is... It's either one or two. But anyway, platform one and platform two are definitely the London Overground with North P1 for the first track. And, oh yes, London Underground terminates here, P2, so then it will switch back and... Uh, it will switch over, sorry, out the way of the London Underground... Uh, London Overground... And head back. For us, we will need to terminate here on the other side. So we might as well terminate here. We'll just go 30 is fine. Uh, we'll stick a signal in for now. We are going to have to do the same here for now. I'd like to get these trains on today. And start, start some services going. We'll do the same here as well. Doesn't have to be that fast. 
I like them to slow down. So we'll do that. Put those in. We're going to need more signals than this. But uh, that's how we're going at the moment. Probably going to have one there. There. Definitely. There, there, and there. Beautiful. I guess we can have one here as well. Ooh, don't you wish we had the like UK gantry things for the signals? That'd be awesome. You can just click them like this. I've such a bad habit of closing every single one or dragging it and opening it as well. Uh, so we're going to need another signal here. Another one on the entry, I guess. Minor signal in work. I think other than that, though, we're, we're good to go. I think we can operate some trains with that that setup. I guess we can uh, we can add one to do this. One there, one there, one there. So that's our that's our get up for now. And it's not upper wheelstone. It would be Harrow and Wilston. Brilliant. More stations. Is this bushy? It is bushy. Well, it's bushy here. Ah, oh, I said I wouldn't do that joke again. And I did. Should we get some trains on? We are going to cheat a little bit. Well, we have this depot here. Somewhere. There. We have this depot here. Which will service this line just fine. Uh, we won't be able to get over onto the main line at the moment, though. That's a little unfortunate. So, we'll cheat with the London Overground. Let's do a little bit of cheating. We'll bring this out a touch. We'll add a depot. But it would be nice to get it going, right? Today. I would certainly like to see them... See them going. I guess since we're doing temporary... Just throw one of those in. Let's have... They're definitely not class 101s. But let's have them anyway. And I think we should have them orange. Because it's the orange line. Bright orange. Beautiful. I don't know how long these would be. I, I can't imagine them being overly long. Should we go with a... Uh, they would be quite nippy. Should we go with a two, a three, and a two? Try and get as much speed as possible. And how many should we have for now? Two? Should we make a line? <laughs> Let's add this in. Orange. So we start here. I mean, there's not much going to be going on. You know what I mean? There we go. I want to be on... Uh, oh, and then back to Bushy again. I want to be on P2 at Watford Junction. It does stop at P2 quite a lot. Is that P2? Oh, I guess that's the wrong way round. I don't know. Yeah, because it's 1 to 4, isn't it? So that's actually P3. Is our P2. Confusing! Okay, guys. So this is... Uh, London Overground. Beautiful. I don't know whether it will be named anything more than that. We'll we'll keep it as that. I don't know whether it's got a service number or whether it's just the London Overground. But we have the London Overground in. That is beautiful. Two trains to start with. I mean, they're just going to be back and forward, right? Let's get them on. Onto the London Overground. Yeah, look at our little London Overground. That's beautiful, except to all the hanging off the edge and stuff. Right, the next one we can do over here, which will be London Midland, we'll start with. Let's make the line. Let's not get carried away. I'm guessing the London Midland is like black and green. What should we go for? Do we have black trains? Or dark, dark green? Dark, dark green. Let's go with that. This would be currently... Uh... I mean, it's 
Let's name it what it's going to be. Houston to... Milton Keynes. Central, I think. That's what we'll name it. Again, we're going to have to have the Class 1-0. Class 101, it's a local commuter. Um, we can have, like, the Class 47 running as an express service when we have Houston in and go all the way up to Bletchley. And we'll probably use Bletchley as kind of like Milton Keynes Central. That's the plan. Yes, we have it in. Let's create the line. I was like, what are we doing? Who knows? Who knows? So we're stopping here, not there. There is one that stops here. That will be Southern. Southern will stop at P10. We're just doing this, though, backwards and forwards. Which is fine. We're more than happy with that. For now, at least we'll get some services running and let them grow. I think that's just given us all the right platforms, fortunately. Beautiful. Yeah, that's that's literally all the right platforms for now. Excellent. I think we'll go for slightly longer trains here and slightly slower. Not too much slower and not too much longer. So probably a maybe a 343. I think that will work. And I'm not trying to sound like football. I know the World Cup's on and stuff. 343, not a bad formation. <laughs> okay, I don't know what. Let's, let's continue. I've got sidetracked. Now I'm thinking about the World Cup. Silly man. Multiple units. Dark green, these are going to be. Dark, dark green. Uh, what did I say? Three, four, three. Beautiful. I think just two on there as well. And off you go. There we go. I kind of like this colouring, don't you? Should we have a little ride on this? I mean, it'll be slow, but who cares? I have got no tea left. I was going to sit back, enjoy the last couple of sips of tea before I have to get editing. And I don't have any. Oh, yeah, I love the screechy screechy wheels against the track. And there, look, there's a London Midland train in the background. Can we see our work down there? Yes, we can. Look, we can see our arches. Beautiful. I was pointing again. I did it again. Obviously, we slow to 15 coming in here. I don't know whether it is 15. It might be more 25, thinking about it. But for now, we'll take 15. I'm sure you guys can tell me what the speeds are coming into uh, the overground section of Watford Junction. So I rely on your wisdom for that. Yeah, look at it. I like the way it chugs in. That is much more realistic. Even if it's 25, we can shift it up to 25. I don't mind. And we have another London overground there. And this is our first train heading off into... Uh... Did you just skip that station? Why? Or did he just come out of there? What's going on there? That's a stop, right? Did I miss that stop out completely? Oh, I bet you were yelling at me, weren't you? I missed that stop, didn't I? How bad am I? We haven't got many stations and I managed to miss one. <laughs> That's amazing. Good job, me. Bushy. What's the point of putting you in if I'm not going to put a... That was silly. There we go. I'm sorry, guys. We might need more trains, then. Let's put another train on. Yeah, let's put another train on, and then we'll call this an episode and sit somewhere. Uh, what were they? They were dark green. One of them. One of them. One of them. Shove all those up. You can also go on that line. Beautiful. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, what he said, if you liked it, like it, all that business, all the goodness, uh, smash the bell if you want notifications, turn it off if you don't, and we are going to get comfy down in, uh, is there any trains? We can kind of sit in between maybe, like here, yes, here we go, we'll sit here, let's get rid of that, let's shove that up there, 
And until next time, guys, take care.